So when I talk about programming, the first seven years of our life, we're almost in a hypnotic trance. We absorb everything from our parents, our grandparents, if we're lucky to have them around. We absorb everything from our siblings, older and younger. We absorb things from classmates and teachers and, and people that are in whatever your religion is and people that are involved in our churches, our mosques, our temples, whatever you go to. We're constantly learning from our environment and we get programmed by what we see during those first seven years. Those are formidable years. You know, a lot of people say it's the teenagers, the first seven years of your life, how you feel about money, relationships, and how you feel about others, and how you feel about yourself. That's the beginning part of this quote unquote program. So most people, when they get to adulthood, are programmed to act within a certain pattern based on what their pattern was in the past. And they continue to live that truth by thinking in the same patterns and therefore behaving in the same patterns from the past. Let's say you establish a pattern of quitting jobs all the time. Well, you know, your truth becomes that cycle because every job you get to, you go and you compare it with the job previously, one way or another. And after a while, you start to judge where you are in life with your familiar patterns. The thing that one must do as an evolving human being is to consistently recognize your patterns and form new patterns of behavior so that you are in charge of your future rather than being relegated by your past. Consistently to strive to recognize it's okay to go backward as long as the view is right, right? Go backward, fucked up there, made a mistake there, I lost a good job. Now I need to make new patterns. But what are patterns? Patterns are a series of habits that form routines. And those routines form a lifestyle. And your lifestyle is an example of all the patterns of behavior you have melted together. You have no one else to blame, especially in adulthood. If you want to grow as an individual, you gotta break some shit. And that means breaking your patterns of behavior and establishing a new positive habits that ultimately lead to routines and lifestyles and patterns for the future. So just because you fucked up in the past doesn't mean that you'll continue to fuck up in the future as long as you interrupt your patterns and break the behavior that's causing the shit in the first place in your life. Take responsibility and just because you break patterns doesn't mean you're broken. It just means you're improving. And if you like real shit like that, I don't have a psychiatric degree or a psychologist degree. I'm just about real shit that I see. I've led many people. I've been led by many people. And I've seen what works and what doesn't work. You don't need a prescription for shit unless you really work this out of your system. So introducing the morning jam, remember to journal, do affirmations and meditate to recognize those patterns, write it down and then make a consorted effort, a conscious effort to break your patterns and establish new ones. And with that, if you like the content, great. If you don't like the content, that's probably your pattern. You don't like shit. Talk to you soon.